Hey, it's Lala Flower Girl. Um, we had an update in Ireland, and boy, what an update it was! It's certainly caused some people to be a little bit upset about certain things. I myself included. The um, first thing that bothers me about it is the daffodils, the red and yellow daffodils. It kind of, I guess, it makes it okay for people that don't have much and and that. But for me, it kind of ruined the. The red and yellow economy but you know I guess it's part of the game they're gonna make changes but at least now they've put a timer on it because when it first came out you could just buy thousands of them and at 5,000 and that's kind of kind of ruined the flower market for red and yellow daffodils uh, which in turn affects everything because people can have massive um, flower farms so the demand isn't quite as much but you know they've changed it so there's a timer on it but it's still kind of made it not not really that worth it to have a lot of the um, daffodils in my shop and a lot of people a lot of flower sellers and buyers actually got stung by that because they still had their um, vending machine set at like a million or two million and people took advantage of that and went and just sold 200 red daffodils without you know before we realized that the price was so different but anyway apart from that i think it's a really good update we got our horses so let's have a look at what they say we've got so they've upgraded the quest system which i think is good when it's not bugged but um, i've got some questions about that that i'll have a look at later and they've um i do like that they've put their quests over in the quest log so now you don't have to go out and find the npcs you can just activate them here wherever you are and the rewards well so far it's just like what you would normally get i guess but just yeah i don't know i haven't done all of the quests yet and now we can get the um resource islands we can get more of those we can buy them but i do believe there is a limit how to, as to how many you can actually spawn so you can't like spawn 100 copper nodes on on your um island i think it is still limited and they do run out okay so they're not permanent and we've got our horses so you go and see talia in the hub for horses and a few different um shops and they've added different um things so cletus now has all the cactus spy, um seeds and now you've got you can craft your cactus spike you don't need to go and buy that blueprint i've done the spirit one so the spirits were a bit glitched to start with but now they've got the spirit jars so they're okay i'll show you them in a minute and okay a couple of other bug fixes and things and yeah so we if you do this spirit like if you look over here in your quest log so you've got your available ones so i've activated all of them but you just click on it and i haven't done this one because obviously i'm not a new player so i haven't done it so and then you just press start quest and then it comes up into your in progress ones so these are the ones that are all in progress so you just have to go out and do what it says so it says uh, I've got these harvests the wheat so I've got over here I've got a little wheat plot so I'll just harvest it and you'll see it will come up as completed in a minute okay so that should have completed so let's go and have a look so there we go 20 wheat has been completed and then it adds the next thing so it's like a quest chain so you can't really skip down and do what's at the bottom first it gives you a progressive quest so the next thing I need to do is plant some tomatoes so I could use this same plot get rid of my wheat and I don't think I've got tomatoes on me no I'll have to get them out of the um of storage but then I just plant the tomatoes and then you can do the tomatoes in a few minutes when they spawn and I have done 
I have done some, so I've defeated Fanhorn, and I, I was silly. I didn't eat my Fanhorn pancakes, so I only got two, two flowers. That's all I got. And the spirits, the spirits was actually um, quite good because you actually get more spirit jars than what we got before. So before we only got 140 of the spirits to spend now you get uh, 200 and something I think it was so I was able to buy four four of the seeds yeah I was about able to buy four seeds so that was really good and I think I still have some spirit jars yeah so you, you actually get them in your bag so this is the spirit jar that you get as a reward and this is your currency on spirit island but you can't place them I don't even know if you can no you can't drop them either so they're just for you personally but they actually look pretty cool I like the look of them even though you can't place them I think they're a cool currency to actually have in your bag um what else have we got uh let's have a look so I can go to pirate island and collect kiwi fruit and then I think these will always um once I've caught the puffer fish here then it will progress on to the sharks so at the moment I've got to get three white rabbits I'm not sure why that's there twice but and I've got one so far so we've got to do that and I've done I did when I did core I break some diamond rocks so this is not diamonds this is the actual rocks so you've got to break 25 of them so that will take a little while and I'm on to catching green fireflies and I've just plum, planted some fruit trees so that I can do the pharmacletus like the fruit tree one so I've just planted one of each so I can come down here and so I've got to pick apples first so if I pick apples you'll see it will come up down here that I've picked an apple so yeah if you've got lots of trees then you'll get through them really quick but I've only put one of each tree here so I've got one of each fruit tree here so as I progress through I'll just use whichever one it is so so these quests they take a little bit longer in some cases to do they're a bit you know but it is progressive and I am not sure because I've completed these ones I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do them again like because they haven't come up in my available so I haven't got them so I'm not sure how often they're going to return and how often you're going to be able to do the same one because like I was doing the spirit island ones every day but I don't know if I can because it hasn't come up again but then it hasn't been a whole day yet since I did it so I have to wait and see how that goes when when that timer comes up whether I can do it again um so yeah we might actually go to the hub and have a look what's changed over there um actually i might first i'll take my horse with me because <laughs> i like the horses so they're really cool so i will come down here i could have used that teleporter as well oh i've just changed this area so it was a bit confusing so okay i can get in here and i have my horses here so you can mount your horse if you've got the right level and everything and then I'll just jump off because that'll take me back and we'll go to the hub and we'll see what we can get and what's new and what's changed okay so here we're in the hub and I'll show you Fulco first so you can see here that it's come up that I can purchase so it's obviously been a, a 24 hours since I last bought them so you can purchase it and then your timer comes up so you can purchase them which kind of like you know with the quests before it made it a little bit harder so yeah now it's just easy just easy and it's kind of ruined the daffodil market but we will see how that goes but now they've changed Cletus over here so you'll see that we've only got Cletus we don't have the sell crops so Cletus does the buy and sell so he can do both you can sell your crops and you can sell all your crops here 
So that's what's different there. And the, to find the miner to get your um, mining deeds, you just come and you take this first left and you go all the way down here. Now the, these horses are actually... Well, they were really fast yesterday, but now I need... If I have my... Eat my speed boost, it should make a difference. So they get a little bit faster. But they're super fast on your island. And here is Jade. So here we go. You can buy your copper and your gold. So your gold is 400,000 and your copper is 150,000. So I don't use them on my flower farm. So I don't, I don't need to buy them just yet, but I will try them and let you know how they go on another character maybe. Um, what else has changed? Oh, the horses. So there's your portal and Talia is right here. So you can buy them and you do need to be level 51 in um, animal care. So, and they're 20,000. Now, the way that I got my animal care up was just catching fireflies and um, harvesting the honey from the bees to start with. So, and even if you go to Spirit Island and catch spirits, you get um, animal um, XP as well. And there are a lot of um, different ways you can get it. it just, yeah. But yeah, catching um, fireflies, frogs, I'm not sure about frogs and rabbits, but definitely your fireflies and harvesting your honey. That will give you um, animal XP if you haven't got much. Alright, um, what else is there? Let's go and see if there is... So we can just go to... Pirate Island and I think I can get there from here. Yeah, Pirate Island. <laughs> Save me running all the way down to talk to Hannah. I do like the teleporters, they are very handy. Alright, so while we're here, we're just going to do the obsidian. So you just go straight through past little pirates and it's on the side of the mountain on the side of the volcano so we'll just go around and break them okay get rid of shadows and music All right, five this won't take very long Horses are well, like I said, they <laughs> I eat the um, speed boost food, so it helps. That, so how many have we got? Oh, that's 10. So, some of these quests don't take any longer than what they did before, they're the same sorts of quests that we had. It's just easier, you don't have to go around and collect them from individual. NPCs which I think makes it a little bit easier and you can pick and choose what you want just like before you don't have to do them all but we'll see what our reward is going to be for this one see if we probably will progress on to the next one I think oh, he's gonna hit me <laughs> that's all good I think there's a quest to hit him back so I might do that in a minute. Okay, one more and we'll see what it does. Okay, so that one is complete. Um, I'm not sure what I got. <laughs> Let's have a look. Completed. Break obsidian rocks. I don't know what I got, but I'll, I'm guessing that I would have got some currency so if I went and like spoke to Davy see no nah, we've got no doubloons so I don't know what I got out of that 
<laughs> oh, I'm not sure if that actually just came up as completed. That doesn't seem to have given me anything at all. Alright, well what's another one that we can do? We can... Fight angry crabs. So <laughs> let's get a weapon out. Um, let's use that one. And just... The crabs are anywhere along the shoreline really. See if I can find some. Okay, where well you get doubloons from? to come out of the water. I don't think I'm actually hitting them. Ugh. Okay, we'll try this one, shall we? <laughs> okay, that's better. So we got three. Let's see if we can find some more. Over here somewhere. Oh, there's some over there. So now I've got to kill 20, so it's progressed. So and now... In progress... Where is it? Okay, see so there. Now I'm going on to the next one. Okay, so there's another two. Well, I guess it's making people come out and do the quests I guess but, and I think there's something to do these ones as well and we have to kill some of them Let's do that while we're here <laughs> oh yeah go and get three of them and I reckon I'll probably progress on and we'll have to do more now we need, now we need to do 15 like the horse. <laughs> it's nice and fast. Quite like the horsey. Now where's some more over here? Put get a couple together. I'll have to eat something in a minute. Always keep an eye on your own health as well. like a, a knight on, on my horse with my sword. <laughs> Wait. Well, there he is. I lost him. Okay. How many have we got? Nine. We need 15. Oh, that's 10. Let's see. Okay, so that's another crab gun. Skeleton, let's see. More skeletons. Always keep an eye on your own health as well. Fourteen. Oh, one more. Okay. So that one is completed. Now I just need more crabs. I'm not. Uh, hang on. I don't need them, do I? Just need to get the crabs. Oh. It's lagging. Is that me? Yep. <laughs> Of course. Uh, I'll be
be back in a minute. All right, and we're back. <laughs> Sorry about that. Got disconnected, and then I had the migrating data, so it took me a little while to get back. Not that you would notice. <laughs> All right, I'm going to go down and see if I can. No, because I haven't been here, my apples haven't grown. That's fine. Uh, what else have we got? We've got. Okay, let's have a look where we're up to. Okay, so we got that. We still got. More. I wish it would tell us what our rewards were. <laughs> um. So yeah, they're just going to progress like that. So I actually don't mind the quest system, but I do wonder when are they going to come back? Are they like a a daily thing or a weekly thing? I don't know. We'll have to wait and see what happens later. Later today, because I did the spirits last night. So we'll see what happens with that one. Yeah. Um. Overall, yeah, there's a few good things about it and a few not so good things like I said I don't like the daffodil situation but you know I'm not a dev I don't have any influence at all but I do like the horses I like the horses they're then cool they're fast and I do like them I think that they're a lot of fun I actually prefer to ride a horse than a duck <laughs> so. all right so I'm gonna put that one there and yeah and I've got I changed my animals so I don't know anyone who's been here before would know that they were over over there where the fruit trees are so I've changed it to be over here now so yeah hopefully that'll be alright but I find animals can jump so high now like I've had to put these blocks are like seven high and yeah and if you're not careful they will jump off the edge so if you put like a little another little bit out here they'll try and jump across it and fall off i had that happen before i had a little gap here and they all jumped off so yeah silly animals right. anyway i'm gonna leave it here and yeah hopefully that was a little bit helpful to get through some of the quests um yeah if you could leave a like and subscribe and that would be amazing and i will see you next time bye